Number two is asking a very easy question. It's asking us, what is the 35, what is 35% of 60? It's asking us 35% of 60. So all we have to do is if we want to convert, um, well, every time we see a percentage here, um, we want to convert this basically to a fraction or to a decimal, right? So if we're looking here, we have a percentage. We either want to convert into a fraction or decimal. So in this case, I would probably convert this into a fraction just so we can kind of manually calculate it. So if I have 35% here, I'm going to convert this into a fraction. So I know that this here, 100% here, is I'm going to divide it by 100%, right? I have, if I want to convert this to into a fraction, right? So this 35% in fraction is obviously 35 over 100. And I can always, um, I can always reduce this to lower ter lowest terms, but uh, in this case, uh, it's not needed because it's not my final answer here. So 35% as a fraction is obviously 35 over 100. Again, for percentages is always just a number divided by 100. And then simply you t you're going to take 35 over 100 multiplied by 60, right? I can say right, 60 over 1 here or multiplied by 60. I can cancel out these terms here. So I have a 10 here and a 6. I can cancel this again to a 5 and a 3 here, right? Um, and then so, or sorry, this would be a... a yeah, I'm dividing both sides by 10 here. So I get 10 and 6, and then I get 5 and 3, yes. So then I have, um, so now I have, let's see, 35 times 3 here would be uh, 105 divided by 5 here, which equals 21. So this here is, um, is our answer here, which means 35% of 60 here equals 21. 35 times 3 was uh this this is a three here 30 times times three is 105 and then five times one is five and then i simply just divided both of these numbers 105 divided by five here is 21. so this solution here is correct the answer 35 percent of 60 is 21.